much. So here we are at the O2, and Joe Cullen has just won his second Premier League night, and he's now favourite to go to Berlin. Yeah, unbelievable, isn't it? I think most of us are guilty of probably writing off Joe's chance because the performance level hasn't been great for him, but he's turned the screw tonight. He's played his best starts when he's under massive pressure, so fair play to him. It basically sets up a tie with Peter Wright. Gavin Price has still got an outside chance, but it basically sets up a tie, doesn't it, with Joe and Peter next week for that fourth spot. And if Joe got on those players, what achievement it would be? Question marks around certain players, and like you say, we picked it all up, but maybe Gezu was in the driving seat. But how much confidence can Joe take from this into next week? A lot of confidence, just be careful with it. Gerwin Price, I thought, would crack it. I thought he was back last week and he, 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 he uh, succumbed to my first game. Joe's got to be careful next week. Just got to ride a storm, enjoy it, but get ready. It's a big game. It's, it's as good as a knockout game, isn't it? I know Gerwin Price is still gate crash, but Joe wins that game, you think he goes to playoffs. But Peter Wright's got to find some form from somewhere. It's a massive match next week. Speaking of that form, we saw Peter tonight. He, he won, but wasn't convincing. And then in the semi final, just didn't look comfortable the whole night. Other concerns? Yeah, I. I I think he was kind of hoping that was enough. I think he was just hoping to stutter his way there. Peter Wright, don't don't worry about Peter Wright. He's played some big games, played in World Finals, Match Play Finals. He'll be ready next week, but it's going to be some tie him and Cullen. And uh, yeah, obviously the subplot keep going as well. Gezi as well. He's in the mix. It, it just adds to the fact that this format does work and uh, will add excitement in Newcastle next week. Top three all done, Basil. I say all eyes on that race now. Three or four weeks ago, did you think it was going to get answered the wire? Well, no. Yeah, Peter Wright's on 20 points four weeks. Weeks ago, you don't think he's going to be on 22, well, five weeks later. And I think you'd feel the same, everybody feel the same. You think he's going to find some more points. So, no, I mean, I've got it wrong. I'm glad I've got it wrong because it's exciting next week in Newcastle. I thought the top four was wrapped up, but it's not. But I mean, it's going to be exciting in Newcastle next week. And um, it backs the format up. We have too many nights of the judgment now. There's not enough to play for on the final app. We've got plenty next week. That's Joe Dirt. <laughs> Yeah, of course he does. Yeah, he's done the. Look, he's come out fighting tonight with the pressures on. He's going to be under loads of pressure next week. It's, it's a, probably a bigger game for him than Peter. Yes, Peter, we expect to get there. For Joe, do we know if he'll be back next year? Maybe not. This might be his one crack at the Premier League. So go and grab it, Joe. Mark, pleasure as always. We'll see you in Newcastle. Cheers, Cheers.